we have a whole new game coming out. It's called Project Mugen. I believe it will probably change because usually when you have project in your title, it usually changes down the line. But brand new game, brand new open world game. Description says this is a world where reality and anomalies coexist, where all rules can be broken. So let's check it out. Huh? Oh, hello. Got that ubu face going. <laughs> Naked rain, huh? Oh, this looks nice already. Oh, shoot. Is Spider Man? <laughs> it's the next uh, PlayStation Spider Man game. Oh. Oh, that's an interesting concept, actually. Yeah, the world would be messed up if people could actually do that. What was that? As Dila. So their fantasies are coming true. Oh. <laughs> yeah, probably. Oh, this is nice. Oh, yeah, guns. It's a part of her, like, powers. Look how colorful everything is. Dang. Locked up. Is that thing? Well, good luck on that one. Project Mugen. Yeah, so honestly, I'll be completely honest. This game reminds me of like three or four different games mashed together. It reminds me of Sunset Overdrive back on the Xbox uh, One way back then. It reminds me of Scarlet Nexus, because it kind of has that look to it with the characters. It reminds me of uh, the game I have versus working on right now called Zenless Zone Zero. Kind of has that vibe to it. And a little bit of like Saints Row the Third, like just like the wackiness of it and like the driving and you know what I mean? The wacky vehicles and whatnot. So just like a handful and obviously kind of like Spider-Man a little bit, obviously, but not really. More, more so uh, Sunset Overdrive, which is like the grapple hook and the kind of like jet set radio kind of, uh, you know, parkour, like grinding on stuff and running up the walls. So handful of things looks cool. Uh, I, you know, the concept is pretty cool as well in terms of like the fantasies coming true and it being actually like a real thing in the world. But as far as the game goes, I'm looking forward to it. I'm not sure when it's going to come out. But um, yeah, it seems like the characters are pretty fun, pretty expressive, uh, you know, very colorful game. The combat's kind of like, you know, once you're in combat, you're in combat kind of deal. Or you could just uh, jump off the cliff and leave. But it seems very free, very open. So I'm looking forward to it. And um, yeah, let me know what you guys think about it in the comments as well. And that'll be it for me. I'll catch you guys in the next one.